so hello everyone welcome again to this youtube channel so today we are going to talk about the main method in java so why do we write main method like this and what is the meaning of each keyword that we use to, to write the main method so main method as you all must be aware about it that whenever jvm starts uh, execution of java program it looks for a main method so your execution starts with the main method only so we are going to discuss about each and every keyword that we use in main method and what if we remove public from here write private what if we remove static from here and what if we change the return type to any other return type and what if we remove this argument that we are passing let's get started with defining each and every keyword that we use to write in a main method okay so first thing is public so public is access specifier so if you are not aware about the access specifier it means that it defines the scope of a method so suppose if it is public it means that you can access that method inside the package outside the package it means everywhere okay so it becomes easy for jvm to identify the main method if we keep it as a public okay so if i keep it as a private protected or default then it will not be visible to jvm jvm so it will uh, jvm will not be able to start the execution of java program okay so that is the reason we keep it as a public so next is static so static keyword we use because if you use static keyword with any method you do not need to create an object for that method so it becomes easy for jvm to call a main method without creating an object so that is the only reason that we are using static here so again i am reiterating whenever you write static in front of any method you don't need to create object of that method okay so that is why whenever jvm will call a main method it it has not to create any object of main method so that is why we are using static and next is void so it it is simply telling to jvm that this main method is not returning anything okay so that is why we are using void with the main method okay so main method is is just a signature that it's the name of the method main method and string arguments it means string array so this main method takes as an argument string array if you write anything instead of string array it will not take it as a main method although you can override ov overload the main method but that will not be counted as a main method that will be counted as a simple method okay so let me show you this is a bit confusing let me show you this in eclipse so i am here on eclipse and i have write this main method here and i am just printing the test okay so let me just right click and you can clearly see that it is giving me option to run it as a java application so if i run it you can see in the console that it is printing the test okay so now what if if i just remove this public and just save it then i'll just try to run it it is not let me to run this java application because main method is not present if i control z this and save it and right click on it it is letting me run as a java application because main method is there because this is the syntax of main method what if i write it as a private okay then you can clearly see it is not giving me option to run as a java application because this is not the syntax as and same goes with the if i remove the static and then i try to run this it is not giving me any option okay if i control z this and again try to run it it is giving me an option so same if i try to remove this argument string array it is not letting me run this so basic thing is that you should have a main method with this exact same syntax okay or you can simply i can do this as well if i write it as an static in in the starting of public you can run you can write it like this but this is just you are changing the place of starting and interchanging the place of starting and public you can write like this and also in string args you can i can write like string x it is 
letting me run. So now I hope you understand that why we write a main method like this only why we are using each keyword in the main method i hope you like this video and if you like this video please subscribe to this channel thank you